Hi, I'm Wolf Ligo, and today we're going to go over some fundamental body position for shooting and passing. Okay, the first thing we're going to talk about is our body position. Okay, a couple really important things. Um, first of all, with our off hand, so for me that's my left hand, I'm going to have it extended out in a really hard sculling position. One of the main things I want to do is I want to keep this lead shoulder out of the water. Okay, so if I'm shooting the ball, last thing I want to have happen is, is I'm leaning forward and this shoulder's in the water. So I need a, a strong base of stability, hard sculling, okay, keeping this lead shoulder out of the water. Okay, so it's going to look like this, okay, not like this, or low in the water. So your lead shoulder needs to be out of the water. For that to happen, you've got to be sculling hard, but also driving your legs. Anytime that you have the ball, you have to be driving your legs 110%. Okay, you can rest once you've passed the ball off to someone else. Next thing is your leg position. Okay? I'm going to have my left leg under me as a pillar of support. That's what's going to allow me to rise up out of the water. Okay, and my right leg behind me is going to be back. So I'm going to have my right leg back, my left arm out, and my left leg under me like a pillar of support. Okay? My right leg back is going to give me a lot of uh, power and movement forward towards the goal. Okay, so if I'm if I'm got my legs both straight under me, it's going to be really hard for me to get my power using my whole body. Then I'm just going to be relying on my arm. This way I can engage my core, use my whole body to come through, finish with my wrist and get a great shot off. So as you can see underwater, okay? Lead shoulder out, right leg back, left leg up, and then I can still have the ability to rise up and fire the ball. So that's a great way to get in position for shooting. The next thing in our body position is our arm position. Okay, so we want to have our arm high out of the water, okay, completely up, back and away. We don't want to have our elbow down in the water, okay, we don't have, want to have the ball near the water. So we want to have that ball, take your elbow and pretend you're pushing it up to the sky. So push your elbow up to the sky, okay. Here we don't want to have the ball too forward, we don't want to have the ball too far back. We want to have it in a good position that if any moment someone blew a whistle, we could shoot a, a quick, hard shot. So elbow bent slightly, but arm stretched up, and arm facing forward. We don't want to hold the ball in this position, hold the ball like this, okay, where we're going to have to make an adjustment before we shoot the ball. We want to be in a position that at any time we can shoot the ball. This way we can have a fake where the fake isn't wildly moving our arm. Our fake is just locking the goalie in a good position. And if the goalie has to be up in the ready position, they can't hold that for that long. But just by having great body position, you can put the goalie in a position where he's gonna have to work the whole time.